Hey man, say man, look, check this out, man. I'm this my nigga real tune, you know what I'm saying? The real TV time, man, you know what I'm saying? If you ain't checking in, man, you need to be checking out, man. Real talk, you feel me? Trade in this bitch, man. I'm finna give my story, you know what I'm saying? Hey, man, I hope y'all uh, appreciate, man, you know, me, you know, giving y'all something that, you know what I'm saying, you ain't never felt before, you ain't never heard before, man. It's real, real talk, real TV, man, you know what I'm saying? And everything above, real tune TV, man. Salute. Some of that rebunch, man. Revenge, man. <laughs> Hold up that revenge, yeah. man. Hey, real tone, it's some real money in the room. I, I just want to get the elephant out of the room. Um, well, you know, you've been to jail a few times, right? You've seen, you know, this, you've seen a little bit of that. Okay. Uh, in hip-hop, with you being somewhat of, you call yourself a Houston legend, you know what I'm saying? And it almost can't be disputed. Cause you on legendary album, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Well, we, we figure out the business, but you know you you there. And one thing we can't take away is the documentation. The most relevant thing going on right now in hip hop is the YSL Rico case, and now the TSF case. <laughs> and I'd be remiss if I just didn't ask your opinion on what's going on because it was one thing, you know what. Um, the Gunner situation, Young Thug situation in Atlanta, but it seems like now it's getting closer to home in Houston. Oh, it's home. Man, uh, let me tell you this here, right? I, I, I hit every facility when it comes to the jailhouse. My last bid was a fed bid. I did 62 months on 84 months, man, for a bank robbery. A bank robbery, man, you know, you starting at 20 points, it ain't, it's, it's really it's straight cut. It's not no Rico. It's not no. Can you no. explain the points? Okay, points is well um, the severity of the case. You starting up at the weed. You starting up at like a weed case or some uh, 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 some bull um, scamming type. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Where you can get a six months to a year or whatever. Starting up there, and then you get down to the major cases, the the the, the dope cases and. Uh, the dopes with the gun, and then, you, you know what I'm saying, the robbery cases, the murder, you know what I'm saying, federal shit like that. So the point system go all the way down, you can go all the way to 300, you know what I'm saying, type shit, and then you got a, uh, how many felonies you got at the top. Right. So you, when you get the chart, it's like if you got five felonies and you right here, you get the chart, you can do your shit like this here, and it's going to point to where your motherfucking time is, right there. Right, right, right. That's what your bitch ass looking at, period, in the feds. It ain't no other way around it. So listen to what I'm telling you. They got a choice system. The judge will not go over this choice system unless you take this shit to court. If you plea out, they have to do this. How many points that case meant and how many motherfucking uh, felonies your dumb ass got. So you got five felonies and you sitting right here. It's going to do this here. And wherever that stop at on that chart, that's how much time you are facing. In between, say, 90 to 102 months. You dig what I'm saying? Period. It's nothing that can change it if you plea out. You feel me? So, when I heard about the gun, the nigga asked me, you know what I'm saying? First thing I said, goddamn, that nigga's rat. He a rat. He, 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 if he out of jail and you on some fed shit, you a rat. You know what I'm saying? They do not let your ass out on no fed shit. You dig what I'm saying? They let you out on some fed shit, my nigga. And he, you know what I'm saying? You, you don't burn out the feds. You dig what I'm saying? Uh, uh, the federal lawyers that is hire, it's the same federal lawyers that they hire for your court appointment. You know what I'm saying? So they tell you, you the best thing to do is just go with the court appointment. They're going to do the same shit. They're going to do the same shit, bro. It's, it, that's, that's free game. You know what I'm saying? Point system. It's going to end up there, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? No matter what. So when they see it, you know, you got that. And then... Uh, you assume that first he snitched. I, I'm, I'm saying it. I'm, yeah, I assume. And I'm, I'm going to tell you why, though. Uh, it was said that he they calculated him up to where he didn't already did a year. You know what I'm saying? Right. And they gave him the time served type shit. I said he snitched until I heard it was a state case. You know what I'm saying? Right. See, a state case separated. If I'm in a feds and we on the same case together, that's just what it is. We are one, one entity. 
You dig what I'm saying? So if I say that there was a gun in the car, I plead get get to it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, 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 and I plead, yeah, it was a gun in the car, but I say it wasn't mine, but I'm pleading to the gun, which is basically pleading to aid and assist uh, and, and a 1244A, some shit like that. Uh, no, 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 I'm lying. It's a 922G. It's possession of a pistol, but it's a fed case. You know what I'm saying? They got a 922C, which is a seven year stack. So if you get a dope case, right? They gonna automatically, if you got a pistol in the car, they put a 924C on it. That mean a pistol, uh, uh, using the pistol in commission of a crime. So they automatically put it all seven on it. You know what I'm saying? But that's fair shit. But that's what you get wrapped up in and you don't get out of it. Only thing you do is to negotiate your time. Because they got you. You feel what I'm saying? When the feds got you, they got you. It's 95, it's 85% conviction rate. What might put you in the 15%? You feel what I'm saying? But when I heard it was a state, it's like, if we riding, and I be like, man, that ain't my dope. And you be like, it ain't my dope. Yes, the law gonna do it. I'm gonna take both of y'all together on the dope, okay? You feel what I'm saying? So, goddamn, if we both don't smash, get to it, you know what I'm saying? We both gonna catch it all. They gonna throw the shit away. You know what I'm saying? Right. But they not, it's not... Telling on nobody. It's not just saying that, oh, that's his if it wasn't mine. You dig what I'm saying? Right. So it's a fine line. But uh, when he said that he will corroborate, he going to come back and corroborate there and that put him back in that light. The way. Like, nigga, you on some bullshit. You on some dumb shit. You 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 a tell on him. So, boy, with that TF shit, man, uh, only thing I could take from that, bro, is like, is looking at what they finna what they finna start doing. That's what they finna start doing. They finna start running that Rico act on these record labels that carry themselves like a game. Why they ain't running the Rico act on the real games? You might say. You know what I'm saying? Because the real games don't got that money behind them to push their terroristic activities. You know what I'm saying? As they call them. As they call it, you know what I'm saying. So like, you got TF, TF, TSF. They, you know, it's, it's pistol on air, it pistol on air video. You pimping and pandering bitches. You know what I'm saying? Or, or so, so they say. Oh, oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So they say, and and you you talking about all this other shit, and you showing it, right? Right. You got a visual of this shit. Big, good visual. Every video, thousand of these motherfuckers. Right. You know what I'm saying? And you talking about it. And you, they, they start watching you. Listen. And every one of you niggas really got to look, get around with that money. And, you know what I'm saying? So now, oh, same thing as the YSL. Except it's TSL. You know what I'm saying? We got another one. So guess what? So I was just on, 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 on. On Instagram, Tyler was saying Gunner, if he was Gunner, he would have not said shit. He would have took that little time. You know what I'm saying? He would have just sat back and seen his family on FaceTime. I get it because I would have did the same thing. But now they're in that position. You know what I'm saying? And, and some more free game to you, bro. If you ever hit the Fed, they going to ask you, do you want to tell? Is no exemption to it. It's no exemption. When you go up in that mother, <laughs> I don't know what you in there for. If it's something that they feel like they can, you know what I'm saying, they can get some extra information out for us so they can bust some more niggas, they gonna ask you, do you wanna tell? My lord, you the first time they said it, man. Hey man, the judge like information. I was like, shit, ain't no information. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know. What type of information? I'm in this for Straight bank robbery. You know what I'm saying? Second time he asked me for the shit. Second time I seen him, man. You sure? I say, bro, stop talking to me about that shit, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Stop asking me about that shit, man. What the fucking judge? Is this judge gonna drop this 924C so I can sign for this motherfucking bank or what, man? Otherwise, get your bitch ass out of here and that's how you gotta handle them hoes. Because they gonna ask you. Everybody. I don't give a fuck who you is. Who you know? Who you wanna tell them? And 85% according to <laughs> the numbers. You know what I'm saying? Tell. They tell. They give something, bro. Might be higher than that. 
and, and, and a lot of times it just be niggas telling to uh they just be telling what happened. Well, you know what I'm saying? And that's that's all they needed. You gonna get the you get the see what about I say gun I thought until it's a state, he said somebody, yeah, he did that, yeah. See, when you tell in the feds, they give you this shit called a three B, uh a five K one three B snitch plan. You dig what I'm saying? That's what we call a snitch plan, but it's it's called five K one three B. And three B is basically bust you down to 12, 12 months in a day. You know what I'm saying? Twelve months in a day. They say so so that's one of my I ain't gonna say shit about it. But if you got a co-defendant and they tell what y'all did to in that robbery, you know what I'm saying? They give him the five B. You you know what I'm saying, you'll never know about it. But he sat up in there and gave him the whole lowdown, the whole scheme and why y'all did that. You know what I'm saying? Mm. But if all three of y'all plea out, if, if these other two plea out and beat you to the punch, I'm telling on myself. You know what I'm saying? Then your bitch got to do your time too. You know what I'm saying? I went through this. You feel me? So like, is that, I ain't trying to hear that shit though. Meat like that. They be bringing this in and they that you ain't never even met before. They got off a whole nother jail in Indiana some motherfucking well. They already working with, and they'll put them up in that nigga. They'll testify on your bitch ass like they know you. I know that it, it went, it happened, man. You know what I'm saying? Boss Life Dre, what's up, man? You know what I'm saying? My nigga uh, Slim Third one is right hand man. You know what I'm saying? Boss Life Dre got a nice podcast, man. Look him up, man. Boss Life Dre, man. You know what I'm saying? But uh, Boss Life Dre. Yeah. You know. Well, the difference, the major difference here between the gunman. <laughs> Young Thug case and the uh, Sauce Walker case is that um, Gunner's case was a state case. Exactly. Sauce that's the Walker's difference. case is that's a federal the difference. case. Now I'm gonna tell you, ain't nobody coming home on on Sauce Walker case unless somebody tell. Hard facts, man. Ain't nobody coming up out there. Ain't no Fed bond. There's no such thing as a federal bond. You know what I'm saying? Sauce so might, you know what I'm saying? He might because he got the money. But somebody finna tell, bro. <laughs> I hate to see it, man. I hate to see it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, because, like, TSL blew, they blew up and, and signed a bunch of real fast. Yeah, like 30 songs. So, he so, was counting over 30 so, so who, who, and over so 14. 14. Who, you, who you know really, who you really know, I, you know what I'm saying? I probably a couple of them, but you really, really, really know. Nobody. You don't got damn tell, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But you know, that's you know, that's other that's you know, they bid I ain't gonna speak too much on that. You know what I'm saying? If it is something to tell, you know, opening my skate on that but yeah. yeah. But you know, that's the difference of state in the Fed case, you know what I'm saying? But um And you, were you in the feds of the state? I went to the state and the feds. Hey, real tone, there's some real money in the room.